so today is a big day. Um, I am going to Colchester to see if I can get on a course for music production, uh, which is something I've been talking to you guys about over the last couple of vlogs. Um, did a couple of interviews at Braintree, um, might have smashed them, but they don't actually have uh, the course I want to do, so I have to go to Colchester and do another interview. So I'm just on my way to that now. Um, I'm actually picking Tom up on the way. It's currently 20 to 9 in the morning. My interview is at 10 to 10. Uh, so yeah, uh, it's been an interesting day. Nicola was on a 14 and a half hour shift last night, so um, she's getting some sleep. But then she's going to get ready, and then we're going to come grab her, and then probably go back to Colchester and spend some time there. Because I haven't been there in a little while. Uh, I very rarely go to Colchester, but I want to get this interview out of the way, I want to smash it. Um, and yeah, hopefully I can get the course, and then I'll start making movements in what I really want to do, which is YouTube and music, so I can put the both together. Um, but right now, I've just got to go pick Tom up, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, Matt Blanz. Yeah, so so I am in Colchester, um, trying to find parking, and they wanted to charge me four pound ten for like a like couple of hours. So I was like, "Fuck that!" So I went to the retail park because it actually backs onto the front of the institute, which I never knew. So I got two hours free parking, which is a result. Um, but yeah, I'm a little here a little bit early. Tom's with me. He's just gonna have a look around Maplins, um, keep himself busy. Place is humongous. We walk around for about five minutes, and I still don't know where the fuck I am. So. I'm just getting into the main reception building and I don't think they're going to let me record obviously because it's college but um, I'll try and get some footage but yeah, wish me luck guys, this is the last chance I'm going to get really to start doing what I want to do so. I've just got out and uh, yeah, I've got the place, which is fucking awesome. I'm so excited. A uh, guy I spoke to called Brett was talking to me about uh, all the aspects of the course and it just excited me having all these things at my disposal. And he likes the ideas I was putting across, likes the reason why I'm doing it, likes the plan I've got, um, which is fantastic. So all I've got to do is email him my work. From what he's seen though, he quite likes it and he offered me a place on the spot. So can't really say any fairer than that. It's, it's been a really good morning. So now it's time to find Tom. My phone's still been cut off from Vodafone, which is awesome. And then let's go pick Nick up to come back into Colchester. Eventually. Hey guys, um, Jay's just come and pick me up and we're going to Colchester for the day. We're going to walk about, maybe go in a couple of shops, maybe grab something to eat, a coffee. Uh, we're going to walk around Castle Park. It's a really nice day. Don't really go up there that too, uh, too much, so it'll be a nice little change. Castle Park, we had our coffees and stuff. I had to send a few emails for work, which was a bit poo, but got out of the way. A little look around Colchester, and we're just currently walking around Castle Park, and it's packed. Everyone's playing Pokemon, the weather's great ish. It's a bit overcast, really. But I haven't been down there in a fair few years, and Nicola's never really walked around here, so had a little bowl about, see what's about. There's so many people that I didn't expect to be here, but there we are. It's a really good atmosphere, actually, to be fair. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Yeah, yeah, we 
born in 1954. Nicola is getting her first wimpy. How do you feel? Hungry. <laughs> hungry. Really hungry. She's probably annoyed that she can't get steak. Tom's just playing Pokemon. That's just her. had a wimpy and it was incredible. So we're just walking around Colchester in a minute, seeing some stuff. Really, this is pretty much all we're doing. These two are just fucking about as always. Uh. How was your how was your wimpy? Really good. T tell the world how your wimpy was. It was really good. Um, is that all you got to say? It was fucking incredible. No, it was incredible, yeah. And had a really, really nice strong milkshake. Yeah, thick shakes are incredible, you can't beat them. Wait a minute, we're going to HMD and looking Debenhams for some makeup. So, see you guys in a bit. Later. Um, we haven't recorded in a couple of hours. After Culture Store, after Wimpy, we basically just uh, came back to Braintree because. Tom had a little date, or he was meeting up with his lady friend, call it that. So, uh, yeah, so we dropped him off back at his, and we thought, because we're, we're literally in the area, just around the corner from my sister, we thought we'd just pop in and see her, my little niece and her boyfriend, and we just ended up staying for hours. It's now, like, what, 8 o'clock, and we were just chatting all night, just having a nice laugh and whatnot, and just Tom's about now, so we've just come to pick him up, and we'll have a couple of drinks. We are currently at the gym working some back, shoulders and abs. I've literally just been covered in liquid chalk because I needed to hold the weights and Dean sprayed it all over me. So yeah, that's always good. Now I look like I've had a cum shot by a giant. 